A California startup says it can make gold using nuclear fusion. It sounds like science fiction, a modern alchemist's dream. But Marathon Fusion believes it's found a path to turning mercury into gold. Not with magic, but with particle physics. For centuries, turning base metals into precious ones was the obsession of ancient alchemists. Today, it's high-tech reactors, not bubbling cauldrons, that carry the promise. Using neutron radiation from a fusion reactor, their method bombards mercury 198 with high-energy neutrons, triggering a chain reaction that decays into stable gold 197. If it works, this process could yield tons of gold per year from a single fusion plant. But here's the catch. No commercial fusion reactor exists yet. Everything, every gram of hypothetical gold, is based on digital simulations, not real-world results. Their digital twin of a fusion reactor runs in code, not concrete. And even if gold is created, it won't be safe to touch. The freshly forged element would be radioactive, requiring years, possibly decades, before it can be handled like the jewelry store kind. There's also the cost. CERN's particle collider once created gold. Just 29 picograms of it over four years. Not even enough to see with the naked eye. Marathon Fusion is betting it can change the rules, using fusion energy and AI systems to keep the plasma stable. But nuclear physicists know it's easy to overlook critical physics in a simulation. Still, the allure is undeniable. A future where power plants create not just electricity, but wealth. For now, it's just a bold vision, unproven, radioactive, and years from reality. But if Marathon Fusion is right, the next gold rush won't happen in a mine. It'll begin in a nuclear reactor.